I've heard if you like blow air out your eyes, maybe we'll start crying. Buddy, uh, and welcome to this uh, video real quick. Uh, yesterday I deleted a video. Oh no, he's gonna cry about deleting a video. Uh, by the way, if I look like I have a uh, like I had a mental breakdown, it's not because I have a mental breakdown. It's because I just woke up. It's about like it's about like seven seven a.m. Uh, on Friday. Um, and um, yeah, he was supposed to record this yesterday, but I didn't record it because I forgot completely. And I recorded this two times. One, like a few, I recorded this two times, uh, like about an hour ago. I was trying to record this, and I ended up deleting that one because I didn't like what I was talking about in the whole video. But yesterday, truly, I actually did uh, delete a video of mine yesterday. The reason why I deleted the video uh, yesterday is because I didn't like the video. It's 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 nothing about anything else, but I just didn't like the video. Uh, because the video was very boring and didn't have anything, I was trying to mostly experiment. Uh, I tried to mostly ex experiment with uh, well, with editing on BSDC. I was trying to experiment if I can edit uh, like videos like this where it needs a face cam and like that. Um, um, I hope I hope I hope you guys uh, understand why I did that video because that video was not good. You know, normally if I would ever have to delete a video, I would always reach out, uh, ask my friends should I delete the video and 99% uh, of the time they say no because deleting videos makes you see like you're you're insecure about your videos it's not that I'm insecure about my videos but seriously it's just it's that on YouTube uh, on YouTube sometimes you just have to delete videos I've deleted a bunch of videos actually I didn't delete only one video that Gold Feud video that I uploaded a freaking week ago that video I didn't like it I didn't like it at all it was very Mal interesting, it was very boring and stuff like that. Um, and uh, I've been I've been trying to find uh, other ways of recording videos for you guys. Because first thing, gaming on YouTube is very much dead. We need I need to like see go to something else. If you hear like sounds in the background, it's because the AC is like going in the background. So um, so basically uh, so basically I deleted that video because it was very boring and it, it wasn't interesting. Um, don't get me wrong, I'm not going to be like deleting all my old videos, I'm just going to be deleting videos that I do not like making, or is not funny, not cringy, not nothing. If, some, if something just has no no need, has zero, zero uh, interesting shit on it, no, no substance at all, I'm going to delete that video. It's very bad and I didn't like it, so I just deleted the video. Another thing I want to talk about uh, stuff on YouTube these days. As I said before, uh, gaming on YouTube is pretty much very dead. And uh, upload gaming videos. If you if you want to get pop up from gaming videos, you have to go into the depths of doing something that's completely different. I'm trying to do that as well. I've stopped doing any more playthrough videos. I've been strictly playing uh, games just to make uh, enjoyable, funny videos instead of making playthroughs. I've completely stopped making a playthrough videos such as Red Dead Redemption 2 and all these other ga games. If I'm ever going to be doing a playthrough video, I'm going to do it, uh, going to do it through a live stream video, uh, which hopefully I'm going to be live streaming very soon. Uh, uh, so uh, the gaming videos are mostly just going to be uh, mostly just going to be me messing around in a game that I really enjoy, and I I make it a funny mo a funny montage where you guys can enjoy it as well instead of just me ma shitting out another uh, playthrough video. So I've stopped making playthrough videos. I'm trying to do videos like uh, funny moments and stuff like that. Those are the only videos that I would see anybody be big off of. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, and also about the about the YouTube sort of thing. YouTube has been basically not allowing me to get uh, get any amount of viewers on my YouTube channel. Uh, just zoom in the camera for a second. Oh, I'm so basically, YouTube doesn't recommend my videos, not even to my fans, not even to my fans that YouTube doesn't recommend my videos. I've tested it on my second account, uh, uh, well it's me, Yosef. I've only subscribed to like about three or four people on that account, uh, me, uh, a couple of my friends, and a couple of other like podcasts, so like, um, it's like... I don't know, a bunch of other podcast channels and stuff like that. I've I've seen that I don't even get recommended to my own viewers. So when you go on YouTube, if you don't know, when you go on YouTube, when uh, when your homepage is up, uh, when you open up your homepage, no matter what on your phone or whatever, once you go on your phone, you once you go on your phone, you go to the freaking YouTube page, 
first thing, first function, first thing is the this page, this home page. You should you should be able to see that that this whole home page, that this whole home page is that it's people that you watch and some new people that you don't watch. So seeing as you can see here, it's all just recommended people. It's recommended reject accepts kind of period file stuff. Then you normally recommend your own people and also recommend uh, new songs and new uh, new uh, stuff like that. Uh, so it just recommends stuff that you, you watch and stuff like that. And also, when some when some you, new uh, you, a YouTuber uploads a new video, that video gets shifted up to the top so you can watch it first because it's a newer video and it's recommended to you to watch it. For me, this doesn't happen. This just doesn't happen. I've checked it on multiple different uh, multiple different accounts. I have two accounts: my business account, and also my second uh, my second my second channel account. Um, I check, I check that on both of them, none of them show my videos, none of them. The bare minimum that they show my videos is either if they don't have, if they're not subscribed to anybody else but me and like two more people, which is bullshit because it's supposed to recommend people that you subscribe to and you watch. Instead of giving you a notification, some people don't press the notification bell, they just press the subscribe button. Which is bad because that means that means some people that I don't press the notification button for, I'm not gonna be able to see their videos except if it gets recommended to me. 99% of my, my viewers don't click the notification bell. If you actually want to be able to see my videos every time I upload, please press the notification bell. But for me, recommendations don't don't, don't work and don't worry about anything. For me, it's all about the audience. If I didn't have an audience, I wouldn't be making these videos. If I didn't want to make these videos. I wouldn't uh, want any of this. I don't care about the numbers. I don't care about anything but the audience. What you guys think is the most important thing for me. When you guys don't watch these videos, it really doesn't make any sense because because I want to entertain you guys. But if you guys don't watch the videos, then what's the goddamn use? If I just make these videos and none of you watch them, will not help me because I'm trying to make videos that you guys will be entertained by. No matter what, it's not it's not because it's funny, it's not because of anything. I'm trying to mostly entertain you guys with each video that I make. Um, but if you're not there to watch it, then what is the point? What is the point if you guys subscribe to the channel if you're not gonna go watch it? But it's mostly most mostly YouTube's fault because YouTube the YouTube doesn't recommend me to my own fans who don't click the notification bell. If you want to see any time I I upload, please subscribe to the channel and actually click the notification button to see when I upload every time every time instead of actually having to go, go through this whole stuff make sure to click the notification bell if you actually want to see more of these videos prevalently without YouTube just just pushing me away and putting all these other youtubers uh, onto the onto their onto their site except me now really I just don't understand because I'm understand the times I upload these videos and not and only like a few of my 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 uh, uh, subscribers so I can click the notification button see these videos which is annoying we're supposed to be the whole fan base 99% of everybody's fan base doesn't click the notification uh, notification button it's just straight facts uh, not everybody clicks the notification button and no not everybody wants to see when you upload every every day so that's the reason mostly because of that because YouTube do, not many people like to click on the notification bell the only thing that will save this YouTuber from not clicking, I do Chax Films recommended to me every time because I'm subscribed to him, but I don't have him on my, uh, on my freaking, uh, I don't have him in my, uh, notification bell, but it's just there because I, it's just there. It's just there because I, because I, because I subscribe to him. Which is really really cool. It will help him maybe because I don't click the notification bell all the time because I don't want to get uh, bombarded with more notifications. I only have notifications for a couple of YouTubers. I only have it for PewDiePie, Jacksepticeye, and NerdCube, and all the other, other creators that I watch all the time. The problem is, is that when 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 does it fix itself? Like when does when 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 will I become recommended? YouTube always say that uh, you have to be 1,000 subscribers to be any of significance on your YouTube channel. It should not be a thing on YouTube. You should not. You should. You should not be having to get 1,000 subscribers to be any, of any significance to anybody who watches your videos, which is bad because you're not going to be able to see other people's videos, such as um, such as videos from Dead Pikachu or people like like that don't have over 1,000 subscribers that I watch. 
Uh, let me real quick give a shout out real quick to Aaron Jones, uh, Dead Pikachu, and ZachMax91. Uh, all of them are really good YouTubers. You go check them out. Uh, I found something really, really cool because as soon as Dead Pikachu hit 1,000 subscribers, that's when I started getting recommended to my own viewers, to my own people who subscribe to my channel. That's when I started actually get. I, that's when he started actually getting freaking recommended to me. Normally, before he had 1,000 subscribers, I used to have to get only notifications and stuff. That as soon as the Pikachu had 1,000 subscribers, I started getting recommended his own videos. I probably can find one of his videos in, if I just scroll through this. Bam! I just found his video. You know, I'm not recording him on the phone. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just seeing it here, and I already got recommended him. As soon as you hit 1,000 subscribers, that's when YouTube thinks of your any significance. No, we do not want that. Nobody wants that. Nobody wants to wait until he has 1,000 subscribers so he will get recommended to his own viewers. That should not be a thing. That should not even be close to a thing. YouTube should just recommend you because you subscribe to this YouTuber. You subscribe to me, YouTube should just recommend those five videos to my viewers who click the subscribe button. It shouldn't be like that. But instead, YouTube doesn't do that. They just want you to go and find my channel so you so they can so you can subscribe to me via that way which is annoying which is not helpful it's not going to do anything to help any any creators if they're not big channels or not, if they're not over like 1000 subscribers which is bad don't get me wrong i don't do this i don't, uh, don't uh, again don't get me wrong i do not force myself to make these videos i do these videos because i love making youtube videos but if you're not there to watch it then what's the point when is the point? Don't get me completely wrong about this. It's just that YouTube doesn't recommend my videos. I've been doing YouTube for literally four years. September to September 5th, I think, uh, when I started this channel. But I have multiple other channels that I used to do YouTube videos on like for like 2014, I think. Let's see, September. I joined YouTube on September. If you can actually focus, focus, please, focus. Focus. I can't, I can't focus. Can you actually see that? Can you focus, please? Focus on this thing. Stop focusing. Okay. So on YouTube it says uh, joined on September second, which is uh, which has passed around uh, around 20, uh, 25 days ago, and I haven't talked about it at all. But I've been doing YouTube for four years. I've started doing YouTube for four years. In this exact same day that I made this channel. I have made a video and uploaded it. I don't, I don't think exactly, but I think it was like the 5th, 5th of September 2015 was my first video. So, so the problem is mostly it's just that you guys don't check out the videos. So if you guys want to get notified anytime I upload, make sure to click that notification bell. That's all I need to say, all I need to say for this video. YouTube doesn't want to recommend me, make sure just to click on that notification bell because the notification bell will help lots instead of YouTube just being so confusing every time I upload a video or every time I want to upload a video so instead of that I don't want to do these videos I'm not forcing myself to do these videos I love making YouTube videos to entertain people but if you're not there to watch them what is the point what is what is the point of me making these videos if, if I had to do that I'll just look at look at my video folders and just start watching these videos like through my freaking phone like this like watch my videos through my phone instead of actually caring about actually uploading these videos so really if I'm not able to make these videos if I'm not able to reach out to the people who want to watch my videos who click the subscribe button then what's the point? YouTube doesn't care YouTube doesn't care if you're if you're less than 1,000 subscribers, which should not be a thing. YouTube should recommend you no matter what your sub count is. If you subscribe to somebody, YouTube should recommend you no matter what your sub count is. 100, 200, 300, even freaking 50. It should recommend you because somebody subscribed to your channel and they enjoy your content. That's why they press the subscribe button. YouTube should recommend you to your own viewers no matter what. No matter what. No matter, no matter what, no matter the sub count, no matter how much views you get, no matter how, how this or that or the other happens, you should just recommend you. Which they don't do that. So if you guys want to get notified anytime I upload a video, click the subscribe button and also click that bell button. So you make sure to be able to see these videos when they first come out. 
And now, I'm gonna go, uh, watch some Minecraft videos. Um, and also, I've been actually working, working on a song for about, like, a few a week, I think. Uh, uh, for about, like, a week, and that's it. So, uh, so, so the video, the song will be coming out very soon. Um, uh, also, um, I have recorded a Minecraft video with Zach Max. The remainder of Zach Max. And uh, I hope you guys go check that video out. As soon as this video is up, I'm going to be uploading those videos uh, pretty uh, periodically. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and make sure to click that bell button. I never say in my videos, but make sure to smash that bell button. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to go watch some uh, Minecraft videos now. As I said.